Good afternoon, folks. This is Fiona. Even though Fiona is letting me pet her right now, Fiona and I aren't really best friends. Don't let the hat fool you. The truth of the matter is, I am afraid of horses. Absolutely scared to death. There is no way that you would see me on the back of Fiona riding her around. Why is that the case? Well, I'm not completely sure why that's the case. Well, yeah, I guess I am. You see, I'm not really afraid of being thrown from the horse, although that would hurt. When I sit on the horse's back, and I have reins in each hand, and I pull on the left, I expect the horse to go to the left. And when I pull on the right rein, I expect the horse to go to the right. And when I say, giddy up, I expect the horse to giddy up. And when I say, whoa, I expect the horse to stop. The only problem is, the horse has a mind of its own. And the horse will, in no time, let me know that I am not in control. And so my biggest fear, really, is not a fear of horses, because this horse is beautiful. This horse would never harm me. What my fear is, is that something might happen that I might not be able to control. And you know, as I was thinking about that, during this time that we're living with the pandemic, there's a lot of things that I can't control. I don't know when this pandemic is going to be over. I don't know who is going to come down with the virus. There are so many things that are outside of my control. And you know, if I thought about it, I would really lose sleep about it. It would bother me to the extent that it would affect my appetite. It would affect my day's thoughts. It would affect my relationships with others as I get upset. But you know, one of the things that I take great comfort in is the God that is in control. Theologians call this the sovereignty of God. And it simply means that God knows the plans that He has for us. Plans to make us prosper and not to harm us. And even in the midst of these COVID days, that remains true to us. And so, Fiona, even though I may never get on you and ride you, I want you to know that I think you're a lovely horse. Have a great day, folks.